The trout, the trout, the trout in the towers, the wolf dropped the fish and they all ran away. The trout, he fucked all the trout. The great Jamie Lannister, Kingslayer, both breaker, brought to his knees by the men of the North. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Make sure it's spotless this time. Lord Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all over it. Go on, it's only blood. Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. I will. You'll see. Of course, your lordship. After you take your rightful place on the Iron Throne. I had a hand in it, you know. Hand him what? Capturing him! He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. So what really happened? Someone caught him, I suppose. That's Kenny Man here, and they'll say it was them. You captured the Kingslayer? Aye. Well, I had a hand in it. Aye. A hand round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What do I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. Not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face! You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. This grows more far fetched every time he tells it. <laughs> Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. I don't take orders from you. No, but you take orders from him. You idiot, you're his squire. Now fetch him some wine. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach, and House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Fetch your cup. Tonight we celebrate. <laughs> to Rob Stark, the king in the north! The, the king, king in the north! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the young wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward! To Castle Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! The North remembers! Aye! Got it. Yes, my lord? I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, Men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question of what's to be done with you. It's been on my mind for a while now. With me, my lord? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. It's well deserved, Garrett. Begging your pardon, my lord, but it's long overdue. Arrogance doesn't become you, Garrett. Perhaps I misjudge your readiness for this honor. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Squire! Fetch us more wine! 
Can you give me a hand? Come on. Can I get up to you? Yeah, no problem. I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. Catch <laughs> more wine, scrub my armor, clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. He's a drunk, a liar, and an arrogant prick. Oh, shut up, Bowen. See, that's where you're lucky. Low expectations. If I'd grown up covered in big shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. Who doesn't love bacon? Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. All in line around a fucking wedding. Not me. What? Tomorrow I ride with Roderick and Lord Forrester. Sir Gerard the fucking Great. Unbelievable. Maybe if my uncle were Castellan, I'd be getting promoted too. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. He's got Lord Forrester's ear, doesn't he? I'm sure it didn't hurt. How much further? It's right over there. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing, Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. What? What's wrong? Just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. We need to get back. Now. They're fine. They can wait. No, you don't understand. We need to go. And <laughs> take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Bowen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. <coughs> but what about... What the hell was that about? Slow down, would you? What's the rush? Run! Ready, boys! Whoa! 
Speak up, Garrett. He... he's gone, my lord. There was nothing I could do. Find a weapon. Quickly! Moving, my lord. I'd never make it. They'll hunt us down like dogs. Walter Frey says time's over. <laughs> Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. There's no time to. Damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. What the phrase? I, I won't leave you, you my lord. Can, and you will. My lord, By I... the gods, you will obey me. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. I swear that I will, my lord. Those foresters! Go. Oh, Your Honor, you must do this for your house! Go! Kill those uh. fucking foresters! Uh. 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 With love, uh. Walter Frey! Uh. 